All right, girls, let's look at the RDL. This is an amazing exercise for your glutes, but only if you do it correctly. So we're gonna go to on a couple of common mistakes, how to fix them, what to do to make them even more glute focused. Um, so let's get right into it. Okay, we're gonna go, we're gonna go very quick. Today, just really get to the point. Okay, so first of all, if you wanna do a correct RDL, you have to know how to hinge at your hips. When you are performing an RDL, and that's not bending over, so that's not what you are doing. The focus of the RDL is the hinge movement. So you have to push your booty back. So imagine that I have a band here and I'm pushing my, pushing my sister back. So she, she's breaking at the hips and hinging back. See, that's what she's doing. So she's sending her booty back. Imagine there is a wall behind you when you do it and you wanna touch the wall with your booty, okay? When you are doing it. All right, come back up. And then also see that she has a slight bend in her knee. You never wanna lock them out, okay? Unless you are training quads, but not here. Okay, so let's do it again. Also, you have your stance around shoulder width apart, sending it back. And you wanna make sure, okay, this is good here. You wanna make sure that you don't have to go super deep. How do you know your range? Everyone's range is very different. Everyone's mobility is very different. Many of us has very, very high, tight hamstrings, so you probably can't go as deep. The way you can tell how deep you should go is as you, you found your perfect range when you can push your booty back more, okay? So go back up now. If you go too, too uh, forward down, then you are going to disengage your glutes and you are going to be using more hamstrings, okay? So let's see. Go, come back, we're gonna find her range now. Put, send the booty back, hinge, 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 there. That's it. If she goes any deeper, go deeper, ready now? She's gonna start using her lower back, right there, way too deep. She has a very good range, but it's still deep for her. She's starting to use lower back, starting more hamstrings, but losing the engagement in her glutes, okay? So this is too much, okay, come back. And you also, if you are keeping your leg more straight, that's called stiff leg that list, but even if you are doing an RDA, you can do a more straight legs, that's gonna hit more hamstrings. And if you bend it more, bend it a little bit more, that's gonna engage more of your glutes, okay? And that, now do one when you are more straight. Aha, uh -huh. that's gonna be more, she's, you see what she's already shaking. <laughs> that's more hamstrings. Okay, so let's see a couple um, very common mistakes with this one. Uh, pick up the dumbbells, or you, you can do it without dumbbells, it doesn't matter. Okay, so let's show when the dumbbells are not staying close to your shin. Common mistake is this, you don't wanna do this. Okay, you wanna make sure that you are keeping the dumbbell very close to your shins, like that, the whole time, okay? And then neck, that. That's not good, you don't wanna do that. You wanna make sure that your body is a straight line, like that, everything is, that's too deep a little bit, come a little bit high, like that, uh-huh. Nice in a straight line, okay, perfect. Also, I see very often when you curve, la, yes, that you don't wanna do, way too deep, curved back, hurting your lower back, not good. Okay, let's see the correct form one more time. Stop right there. You can pause a little bit. And here you wanna contract your glutes when you are in this position. This is where your glutes are under the most amount of tension. So now you are contracting it and coming back up. Quickly, bam, right there. And you don't wanna overextend on the top either. You can engage your glutes on the top. You don't wanna do this, right there. Come down, stop, contract, and come back up, right there. That is a perfect, Glute focus, stop right there, and come back up. That's a perfect glute focus audio. Oh, I hope this helped, girls, give it a try.